I'm supposed to film this video yesterday, but by the time I realized it, it was dark. Hey y'all, welcome back to Tabby the Rossa Farm. My name's Chad, back here week five with the stump. I was supposed to do this video yesterday, but uh, if you're following along on our channel, I'm doing a, I'm building a chicken coop right now, a seven by eight chicken coop for our, for our girls to live in. Uh, I'll post that video right here. If you're interested in watching it, um, part one's out right now. I'm currently still building it, so I'm working on part two of the video. So anyway, that's not why we're here. We're here for the stump project. This is week five. Take a look back at the playlist if you need to, to follow our stump kill project here. We're doing it with Epsom salt. We're trying to do it organically. So we're gonna get in here. We're gonna check out, see what the progress is on this, uh, on this stump. I haven't opened it up, just like usual. I haven't opened it up yet. Wait and show it to you guys, so. Let's get in here and check it out. I had to sit on this side today because the sun is coming up pretty early in the morning. Like I said, I was supposed to film this video yesterday, but by the time I realized it, it was dark. Oh, our bucket done rolled down the hill. So kind of the same old song here. A few new shoots trying to come up still. Gang of fire ants in there. I'm gonna clean this off real quick so we can take a better look at the stump because it's completely covered in sand because the ants have built around it. I think the ants are gonna help kill this stump. I think they're gonna help break it down. I think they're gonna help break it down for us. It's about the only thing they're really good for, I guess, if they even do it, I don't know. We're gonna get the stump cleaned off, take a closer look. We got her cleaned off. Still a little bit of salt in these holes, but that's okay. It'll still help draw some more moisture out and kill the stump. But right around here on the edges, the bark seems to be rotting away a little bit. I mean, it appears the Epsom salt's working. This is supposed to take eight to 10 weeks, approximately. I assume this one might be a little sooner because it is a smaller stump, but I'm not sure because this is my first time doing it. Yeah, there's still a gang of fire ants in here though. I mean, I guess it's working. It's just really slow, which, I mean, a lot of things organically, even organic fertilizers are slow at working. They're slow release, they're not quick. So this is gonna be just like anything else that's organic. It's just gonna take some time. It, it should work in the long run. Anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna cover her up again, put another pile of Epsom salt on here and uh, cover it up and come back in a week. All right, got her all covered back up again. Poured some more Epsom salt on there. We'll see y'all next week. I gotta go over where the chickens are. One of my chickens just escaped, so I gotta go out there and catch her. So anyway, appreciate y'all watching. We'll see you next week.